This morning I discovered that I can't have this stacked on this because it makes it too tall and this then hits and won't open. So, gotta figure out what to do with that. But we have coffee, so it's okay. Hi guys, welcome back to another moving vlog. I think we're on number four now. Today's Monday. I took off from work today and tomorrow, so very happy I did that because I still have so much to do around the apartment. Today we're gonna run some errands. I'm gonna go to Trader Joe's and do a big grocery stock up. I really like used up all of my food stuff before I moved out of my last apartment, so I'm basically starting fresh. I need to get all of my like fresh groceries for this week and then also just like all the things I like to always have on hand, like in the freezer and in the pantry. It's gonna be a big grocery haul. Also, I need to run to Bed Bath & Beyond again and get a couple more things that I've realized I need. The Wi-Fi is getting set up. The guy's coming between one and three today, so I just have to be here during that time for him to set it up, but that'll be really good to have that set up. But yeah, and then we're just gonna continue unpacking and getting organized. I can't believe the living room still looks like this. I feel like it looks so chaotic like i've made no progress but i definitely have look at all the boxes i've cleared out i'm saving all my moving boxes and like larger boxes that packages came in because my parents neighbors are moving soon so i'm just gonna save these and give them to them so they can reuse them but i feel like this makes me feel like i've made a lot of progress back from running my errands i'm gonna do a trader joe's haul for you we got like three bags worth of stuff let's just rapid fire go through everything bananas got some apples these are like the shiniest apples i've ever seen lemons garlic a bell pepper and an onion needed olive oil so i got this big bottle got some old-fashioned oats some mac and cheese peanut butter and also a jar of their cocoa almond spread this with strawberries which i also got somewhere favorite dessert got some salsa this is their thick and chunky salsa i've never tried this before we'll see how it is then i got their crunchy chili onion spread and a pack of apple mango little applesauce packets then we got a bag of tortilla chips to go with the salsa got some salmon bottle of pineapple juice a few frozen items that I always have on hand, gnocchi, and then the Thai shrimp gyozas. Also organic brown rice packets, always have to have these, and then got some hold the cones. Then I got my favorite granola. This is their fruit and seed granola. So good. And then just some pasta. Got three perfect bars just to have for snacks. Some almond yogurt, green beans, zucchini, strawberries, blueberries, some mushrooms, and then a chopped salad. I got some whipped cream. I feel like that's good to have on hand. And then also some chicken to use for dinner this week. And that is everything. Going to put this all away now. Just organized this first closet a little bit. Rearranged the shoe boxes. These are all shoe boxes that I had in my old place. I think I want to get one more pack. They come in like six packs. And I can do one more row up here and one more row down there. Just because I have a few extra shoes sitting around. These are from the container store by the way. So I'll pick a pack up next time I'm at the container store. But not super urgent. But I love how this looks. I just put all my sneakers here. And then there are a few other like 
sandals down there, heels in these boxes, and then there's some boots sitting down here. I just have my coats up here, some bigger shoe boxes up there, and then I still need to figure out what I'm going to do over there. But overall, this closet is much better than it was before. Wanted to also just show you guys what I picked up at Bed Bath & Beyond. Just got a couple of things. First, I just needed new salt and pepper shakers. I hated the ones I had before. They were just like regular shakers and like so little would come out. It would just take forever. So I got this set. These are like ones that you grind. And then I just got this over the door organizer rack. I'm going to put this over my bathroom door to hang my robes on because I don't have a spot for them right now. Also just picked up a new bed skirt because my last one had like holes in it. So it was just time for a new one. Then I got this under the sink storage situation to organize this stuff in the kitchen. So I'm going to do that this afternoon. And then last thing I got is this little shelf unit, which I'm actually going to put in this closet here. This is a mess right now with all my like cleaning stuff. So I'm going to put this right here and it's not going to take up the whole closet width wise. So I can still put like my vacuum and Swiffer over here. But it's just going to give me some shelving to organize all of my like laundry stuff, cleaning supplies, extra toilet paper, paper towels, stuff like that. officially have Wi-Fi. The guy just left. Everything is set up. It's working. So that's very exciting. Now I'm just working on putting this shelving unit together so I can get my closet organized. Okay, this closet is done. I'm so happy with how this looks. I had some extra command strip hooks and stuff hanging around, so I just hung the broom and the duster on the wall. And then the shelves look amazing. We have all the laundry stuff, bathroom cleaning supplies, my steamer, extra dusters and stuff down there, extra dog and cat food. And then up here I just have some extra kitty litter and then paper towels and toilet paper. So nice to just hide everything away in there. The only thing that didn't fit was my vacuum, so I just put it in this closet for now. The vacuum's a little chunky, so there's not really a great place for it, but this works for now. Hi guys, good morning. It is now Tuesday. It's my last day off to finish getting settled in. Obviously, I still have a lot to do and it's not going to be all done today. I just have to work tomorrow and Thursday, but then I'll have another three-day weekend to continue getting things set up. I kind of stopped vlogging the rest of yesterday. It was actually kind of a tough day. If you guys know our family cat, Pearl, she's our gray cat. I've shown her in vlogs when I was staying at my parents' house. She's been sick and we had to actually put her down yesterday. Wasn't in the mood to be vlogging and stuff yesterday, but she was turning 15 this year. So we've had her in our family since I was in third grade and she just hasn't been doing well the past few months. So that's kind of why I stopped vlogging the rest of yesterday. But on a happier note, Lennon is here. Lennon! she hears something she is settling in quite nicely i think she like understands that like this is her home now because she like smells all of her familiar things and like all her toys are here she's definitely getting to know the neighborhood there's a big dog park super close to me so i took her there this morning and she was super happy to run around so we're gonna walk again in a little bit it's kind of a gloomy day out but 
it's okay. I have made some more progress though. I actually put together my bar cart. This bar cart is from Ashley Furniture. I'm actually getting a ton of my furniture from Ashley. This video is not sponsored, but I'm actually doing a little deal with them on Instagram. So keep an eye out for that. I am so excited to be working with them and they're just making my life so much easier by sending me a ton of the furniture I needed. So got this bar cart, it's beautiful. I wanted something gold. I love the mirrors. I just need to take those stickers off underneath there, I just realized. Um, but I'm gonna like style this in a little bit with some bottles and some glassware. Also from Ashley, I got this desk chair. My desk hasn't arrived yet, but that's coming probably tomorrow. So this is gonna go with the desk. And then another thing from Ashley is actually this laundry basket. You may have noticed I don't have laundry in my unit, which is a little annoying, but there is laundry on my floor, so I don't have to like go down into a basement to do laundry. Every floor has its own laundry, so it's like rarely ever that all the machines are being used. But since I don't have laundry in my apartment anymore, I wanted to get something that has wheels so I can just like roll this down the hallway when I need to do laundry. And plus it comes with three separate compartments, so you can like sort your laundry as you go throughout the week. So I feel like this is gonna make the actual process of doing laundry a lot easier I just have it in this little corner for now I think I'm gonna get some hooks to go on the wall to hang my bags here also a little update to the kitchen my dad actually got me this new knife set as a little housewarming gift I'll link it down below I think the white looks so cute especially like next to the toaster like I love this little corner I still have this knife set which is also from Cuisinart and these knives are good I'm keeping them but I've had them for a while and I was just kind of do for like a new nicer set i also got this cabinet organized a bit i'm having like snacks up there some like boxed pastas and stuff here we have cereal oats more pasta i still have a lot of empty containers here that i can fill and then we have some like condiments and stuff here things are coming together my parents are actually going to come over this evening when my mom's done with work for the day because i need some help hanging a few things I want to hang the curtains with their help and then also mount the TVs. I tried to mount the TV by myself yesterday and like the stud in the wall is metal instead of wood so I like, can't drill through it. So normally I'm pretty handy and I can mount a TV by myself. I did it in my last apartment but I don't know what to do with this metal situation. So my dad's going to come over and help me out with that. So yeah, that's the update. <laughs> Okay, just did a rough styling of the bar cart. It needs a little bit of work, but I think it's gonna look so cute. Definitely need some more bottles. I just have all my Vogue magazines there. These little cocktail glasses are from Crate and Barrel. These wine glasses are also from Crate and Barrel. I got them this past Christmas and I've been dying to take them out and use them. This is like an old cigar box that came in a PR package. So I don't know, I think it's cute. Then I just have some books. I had like a half full handle of Tito's. Thought it would make sense to put into this thing so it's not like an ugly Tito's bottle. And then just have my shaker and some shot glasses. out the living room rug I think the girls approve it still needs to flatten out a little bit but I just wanted something 
big and neutral and cozy. I think this does the job. I like the little fringe on the ends. But yeah, I think it'll look good once the couch gets here, which is getting here on Thursday. So that'll go there. And then I just got like a white TV stand that's gonna go here. I need to put the coffee table in the middle. It is much later in the day now. It's been a long afternoon, but very productive. My parents came over for dinner and they helped me get some things done that were a more than one person job. So lots of updates to show you. First off, we hung up the curtains. I think the curtains themselves are really nice. They're completely blackout curtains. I need to steam them still, so ignore all the creases. But the only thing I didn't realize when I was buying these is that my radiator is actually right in front of the windows so they like stick out a little bit when they're closed which is kind of annoying we put the same ones in the bedroom so i just tucked the middle panels up so that the heat can still come in and i'm not sleeping in a cold room it doesn't matter when they're open during the day so i don't think it's a huge deal i could return them and get like shorter curtains but i feel like they just wouldn't look as good if they didn't go all the way to the floor so I think it's fine and we just used this tension rod so we didn't have to screw anything into the walls and it was super super easy to hang I'll link the rods and the curtains down below. They're all from Amazon. So that's great And then also lots of updates in the bedroom. We got the TV mounted So that's all done and secure. I need to get something to hide this cord still but that looks great above the dresser. We also put my rug down in the bedroom and I love it so much. This is also from Ashley Furniture. It's so cozy. I feel like it just feels like a warm, fluffy cloud in here, which is exactly what I want my bedroom to feel like. Also, I don't think I showed you guys yet, but I set up the light bulbs in here and in the living room lamp so I can control them all for my phone and I can make them any color of the rainbow my favorite is actually just adjusting the shades of white so I feel like the sunset one is really good for like nighttime I know these can connect to Alexa so that you can just voice control it but I haven't set my Alexa up yet but more updates over here in the hallway this is actually like all set up now so on this wall I have my little cabinet that I had in my last apartment and this used to be like a bar situation, but now that I have a separate bar cart, I made this like my pet storage. So I basically have like kitties food, litter, extra baggies, some like grooming things. I also have all my masks in here. It's just all kind of like cluttery things that are good to just hide away in this cabinet. And then you guys saw I hung this gold mirror up. This is old from Target. And then on this wall, I hung my prints that were in my last living room. I think they look so good here. And then I just have my runner rug that was in my old bathroom but I think it looks perfect here in the entryway. It's from Ruggable, so it's washable. Have Lennon's food and water bowls there. So yeah, this is the whole like entryway vibe. The last thing my parents helped me with is just mounting this mirror to the wall so it doesn't tip over. So I have my big standing mirror again, and that is pretty much it. So I know this room still <laughs> looks super unfinished, but it's really not. I just need to get my furniture and then it'll be done. So my TV stand I think is coming tomorrow and so is my desk for that corner. These dining chairs are gonna go, I'm gonna sell them. I'm just keeping them until I have my other seating. And then my couch is coming on Thursday. So by the end of this week, this room will be like pretty much complete. It's been a long couple of days. Today is my last day off, so I'm back to work tomorrow. So I am just going to sit in bed and edit a previous vlog. So I'm gonna end off this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I hope you are enjoying all of these moving apartment vlogs. I'm having a lot of fun filming them. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on any more videos from me. Love you guys, and I will talk to you in the next video very soon. Bye!